We are going to the moon to inspire the next generation, to advance our understanding of the universe so that we can share the benefits with all, here and now. We are going to use partners who see the critical roles they play as nothing short of advancing the cause of humanity. Today we take the next step in the Artemis program towards our Moon 2024 objective with a partnership that is the first of its kind. Mexar Technologies will launch and demonstrate the foundational element of Gateway, the power and propulsion element. We believe in the need to accelerate the advancements of science, technology, and human exploration. The Gateway is our lunar orbiting station and is a critical piece of sustaining our presence on the Moon as a hub for science, technology, and human travel. The Gateway will allow us to reach areas of the Moon that have never been accessible before. The Gateway will be built in two phases. The first is a minimalistic design that will prepare the way for human landings by 2024. The second phase will see the addition of modules that expand the habitation and long-term science capabilities by 2028, thus enabling sustained missions to the Moon. The initial element of the Gateway and the focus of this partnership is the power and propulsion element or PPE as we call it. This element will be the source of thrust, power, communication, and the foundation upon which all other modules are added. The unique nature of this partnership allows us to accelerate our lunar return. Together, we are poised to meet a launch date in 2022. Initially, the PPE will be owned and operated in orbit around the moon by our commercial partner, NASA will take delivery of the element after a successful demonstration. The systems developed here will drive down the cost of future lunar exploration and enable sustained missions on the surface. It will also demonstrate what is possible for future missions to Mars. One such example of this focused development is the advancement of a proven technology with the PPE's engine, a solar electric propulsion thruster. These thrusters were pioneered in the 1960s and have proven to be incredibly efficient and reliable, with hundreds of thousands of hours of successful spaceflight operations. Specifically, SEP systems are known for their fine control of spacecraft due to their low thrust, their ability to fire continuously for years at a time, and their ability to allow a craft to stop, start, and change directions to visit multiple destinations. This partnership calls for the demonstration of a new electric propulsion system on Gateway's PPE using advanced hull thruster technology the Gateway PPE will provide three times the power of current solar electric propulsion systems. Our return to the moon is now well underway. Maxar Technologies is now tasked with bringing their unique power propulsion element design to life, launching it into orbit around the moon and demonstrating its capabilities to NASA. Their success will put into place the first element of our sustainable return to the moon. We are proud to welcome them to our mission. Together, we are going. For more information on the Artemis program and our plans to land the next man and the first woman on the moon in 2024, visit nasa.gov slash moon to Mars.